welcome to the tutorial of stat pro today we are going to learn stat pro this is the basic screen of stat pro here you can start with a new model or you can open the current project we will start with new project when you start with new project this window is going to be open in that there are different option one is space second is plane floor and truss generally we are selecting with space frame you can select the unit of length and unit of force you can give some name trial after click on next then it will ask where do you want to go you do you want to create new beam or you, you want to create plate element or solid element so we are going to use simple beam <coughs> so after clicking that this window is going to be open this is the window for star pro by default grid line is going to be displayed generally we are not using this grid line so we'll close it now there are different modes in this star pro first is modeling and second is post processing in the modeling part you need to create the if you want to create the geometry you can create in modeling part and after that whatever after analysis if you want to check the result you need to go post processing mode we'll start with this modeling part in this modeling part we are starting with this node here in star pro node to node modeling is used so let's start with the node to node modeling so first we we'll locate first our node we'll start with 0 original 0 x coordinate y coordinate 0 and z coordinate is 0 now we are going to start with another point say 4 meter in x direction y direction we are not we are preparing plan so y will value is 0 and z value is also 0 then another point that is x distance 4 y distance that is vertical distance here you can see this is y this is x and this is z so vertical distance as we are preparing plan so vertical distance is 0 z value also we are giving that as 4 meter so this new node has been created now next is another uh, fourth point which we are going to create so we have four points you can use this pen command to move this here if you see all the four point has been created this command shows display whole structure now this is the very basic 
four nodes we have created after creating this nodes what is next next thing you need to create beam so here there are different cursor like add beam then add four noded plate if you want to create geometry like solid or you want to create water tank then he will use this plate element but right now we are going to use beam so we'll start with that simple beam <coughs> so simple geometry we have created now right now we are at this point geometry so we have added node then we have added beams here there are different cursor one is node cursor second is your beam cursor if you want to select node then this cursor will select the node if you want to select beam this cursor is going to be used here in stat pro after few time it will ask to save the model so if you do that it will save automatically now this is your be uh, beam cursor you can select the beam like this now this is the very basic first plan we have selected now we'll go with the next step to create the column so again this will show whole structure it is displacing displaying whole structure now we are going to create the column now in this in start start pro you need not to create a separate column you can create a different floor so this is if you consider this as a ground floor then what uh, you need to select the whole structure now on we uh, similar kind of structure we are going to use for the first floor so we are going to we need to copy this so here instead of copy command there is a very important command is that that is translation repeat so if you do that it will ask 3d repeat or you can say it is translation repeat now in which uh, there are three direction each which in which you want to copy this structure so here we want to copy in y direction so we will do that we will select y direction and we uh, second thing is numbers of steps means how many numbers of time you need to copy so here simply we are selecting as one default step spacing means suppose the we uh, here we are copying in y direction so first step at zero and second step at some distance uh, so that distance you need to give so if i give that three meter it will it will uh, automatically change if you give more numbers of step so it will come for two story another important thing is this link step so if you want to link this two story then you have to check this box and then you give okay command so if you select if you have checked the option link command this column is going to be created automatically this is very simple basic geometry we have prepared this is your ground story this is your first floor this is your second floor now on the ground floor generally we are not providing any beam but for creating structure easily we are first preparing ground floor 
so we are going to create uh, delete this as it is not used simply select that and from keyboard you can delete that so this is your first geometry part 